The Minnesota Vikings appear to be eyeing a significant acquisition from the Green Bay Packers defense in the upcoming free agency period. Although we're currently entrenched in the football season, discussions about next year's free agent class are already buzzing. While on-field performances hold their weight, the spotlight often shifts dramatically to the free agency frenzy come March. Speculations are rife, even suggesting the possibility of the Vikings snatching Kenny Clark, a cornerstone of the Packers' defensive lineup for the past eight years. Clark's consistency, with six seasons of at least 15 games played and three Pro Bowl selections, underscores his pivotal role. Recently, he achieved personal bests in sacks, 7.5, and quarterback hits, 16, cementing his status as one of the NFL's premier defensive linemen. Losing Clark would undoubtedly be a blow to Green Bay, but losing him to a division rival like the Vikings, particularly at the peak of his career, would sting even more. The mere contemplation of such a scenario has sparked dismay among Packers faithful. Meanwhile, the Packers have their own challenges to address. Last year's decision to defer safety considerations until the seventh round, despite losing key starter Adrian Amos, seemed a gamble that didn't pay off. This season, cornerback depth was a concern, with the team opting to wait until the seventh round to draft Kalen King. While banking on the health of Jer Alexander and the resurgence of Eric Stokes, who showed promise in his rookie year, the Packers are potentially facing a cornerback crisis if Stokes and Corey Ballantyne exit in free agency next year. Looking ahead, the Packers are already strategizing for the 2025 NFL Draft. Recent mock drafts suggest they may target Takario Davis, a standout cornerback from Arizona, to bolster their defensive backfield. The urgency to reinforce their cornerback core is underscored by the impending contract situations of Stokes and Ballantyne. The team's confidence in its current roster may prove to be a calculated risk, particularly given the injury history of key players like Alexander and Stokes. As the season progresses, the Packers' decisions in free agency and the draft will play a crucial role in shaping their defensive strategy for the future.